So my first role is that I'm a coach of a running club called Together We Are Runners and I really enjoy doing this role because I get to support women, especially those from diverse backgrounds, um, basically achieving their fitness goals. Another group that I have is a litter picking group called Together We Are Litter Pickers um, and I really enjoy that group because I get to see families, but especially young people, taking pride in their community um, and just seeing them clean up their own area, which they really enjoy doing. Uh, being able to have an impact on this generation is really important. Um, I also have a volunteer at a local library every week um, and I'm an alumni for my school. All of these things come under my company which is called Together We Are and any funding that I receive goes straight back into the, the groups that I have. So the, growing up there's a lot of societal pressure to go to university and take a traditional route. Um, luckily with the support of friends and family I was able to overcome that and instead pursue my passions. Um, so I didn't take a traditional route but it still led me to a place where I'm able to support people in the community. Um, another barrier that I've faced is that I feel like in a lot of these spaces when I do these training courses I might be the only person of colour in a room which can be quite difficult if you're the only person. The way to overcome this is just by being there um, because representation is the most important thing. My biggest advice would be that if you have a passion for something you just need to seek it out and, and just find somewhere to do it and um, you never know who you could be a role model for. There could be, you know, for me I always think there could be a young girl sat on a bench watching me coaching a group and she could think I could do that. Without representation you don't know, you, you don't think that you can do something um, so yeah just go for it.